Hello, hope everybody's having a blessed day today. I just want to share this dream with everybody and this vision that I had. Um, because it's very, very, um, awesome. <laughs> and it's explaining everything that, that what God has been showing me lately a lot and telling me about changing things in our lives and about changing our situations and taking us from where we are and, and moving us somewhere else. That's what he's doing. He's transplanting us like I was doing with this plant that's in my, the dream that I had. But I was in this, this house with these people, and I walked outside onto the patio, and I saw this big old cactus plant. It was in a big pot. And I walked over to it, and I looked at it, and the thing that stuck out to me, there's actually two things that stuck out to me. It was the long spines that were on the, on the cactus, and the fact that there was no soil in the pot. There was only water, which represents the Holy Spirit. Um... And that was really, that was big because that really stuck out to me. And it was like I was just standing there staring at it for a few minutes. Like I was just like, wow. I was just in awe because I knew what it meant. I knew what it was representing. Um, and cactuses, for one thing, are strong plants. You know, they're very, very strong plants. And they can endure, you know, the harshest environments. Even like out in the desert with no water, you know, for long periods of time. They're, they're strong plants. They don't die easy. <laughs> Um, and I was going to transplant it, but I didn't want to because I was afraid that it would die. So I didn't. I left it there in the pot that it was in. And um, the thing that, that the revelation that God gave me to that was the spines are his protection over us. You know, just like the spines protect the cactus. You know, it's God's protection over us saying that we can endure no matter what situations come our way because he is our protection. He's all we need. We don't need nothing else. He is all we need. If we got him, we got it made. You know, that's it. That's all we need. We just need to look to him. And that's what the the um, spines on the cactus are symbolic for. God's protection. He's protecting us. He's our protector. So we don't have to worry about, you know, or be concerned about, you know, being protected and being safe in no matter what situations that we're in and that we face because he's there with us. And also... Um, the scripture that came to me that really stuck out to me also it about this this dream about the pot having only water in it it was the first thing that came to my mind was that woman at the well and it's such a powerful uh, message too because you know just like jesus told the woman you know drink from the water drink the water i give you you know it's it's all you need you don't you will never thirst again you won't have any more thirst if you drink the water i give you but if you drink the other water, then you're going to thirst again. So you have to drink what I give you. And that's what he's saying also through the, the pot only having water in it. Is he's saying, you know, drink from me. Get your strength from me. Get what you need from me. You don't need nothing else from anybody else or any other source. I'm your source. I'm all you need. You know, look to me. I'm the water that you need. I'm the life that you need. Because water brings life to plants. You know, water with the soil mixed. Give the plant the nutrients and all it needs to survive. And that is what he is to us. You know, he's he's our soil. He's our water. He's our nutrients. He's everything that we need. He, he you know, he's what makes us keep going. He helps us to keep going. He's all, you know, without him, we can't keep going. So he's, he's you know, he's, um, he's all we need. You know, he's, and that's what he's saying through that. You know, he's saying, I'm all you need. Look to me. Just like the woman in the well when he told her that, you know, he told her. I'm not, you know, drink, drink the water I give you. Why you want to drink from a, a source that, you know, you're going to thirst again. Take my, take the water I give you, you know, drink from me, you know, take what I give you. It's much better than this. You know, you know, live the, the plan that I have for you is way better than anything else that you could think of. And, um, also, um, another word that God gave me actually through this, a word that he gave me that's for everybody, um, also is, <laughs> The transplanting part, that's the awesome part because that's what he's doing. And I know I've shared this a long time ago, you know, about transformation, about God transforming us and, and, and transitioning us into to different, a different place, a different situation. That's what he's doing now. So this is big. <laughs> this is bigger than it was then. This ain't just like changing jobs or changing careers or whatever. This is big. He's, he's basically going to uproot you from where you're at and move you somewhere completely different. In a whole different environment, whole different situations, all new things. He's giving you all new beginning. He's starting you all over again. He's like wiping the slate, picking you up and just moving you, saying, okay, you're done here. You know, you did what you had to do. 
Why the time that you were here, now you're done. I'm picking you up and I'm moving you. I'm changing your situations. I'm moving you somewhere else to a different location. And I'm um, giving you a new assignment, more or less. A new a new way of, of life. A new beginning. A new lifestyle. And he's changing your lifestyle. And changing everything that, that you're used to now. He's moving you. <laughs> so get ready. Because this is big. He's he's uprooting you. He's going to uproot you and move you. He's saying, okay, you, you've done what you got to do. Where you're at. You know, your your assignment here is done. Now it's time to move on. So he's going to move you somewhere else to a different location. Um, a different state, actually, probably, most likely. A different state or a different country, a different nation. He's moving you somewhere else. You know, it's not going to be what you're used to now. It's going to be completely different, which is awesome and exciting at the same time. <laughs> um, because God, you know, he, he can, gets us on these journeys that are so awesome and so amazing. And each new season we come in is just you know one amazing thing after another it really really is but i wanted to share this quick word with everybody and pray that y'all have a blessed day and um i will uh leave the links to my uh gofundme um campaign for those who want to sow a seed into my ministry and what god's doing because he's doing some awesome things and i'll also leave my email for those who have prayer requests feel free to send me an email and i will get back to you because i check my emails all the time and i will get back to you and pray for you like I always do. And until next time, y'all have a blessed day. Bye-bye.